Hello and thanks for checking out my procedural vehicle asset pack. This video covers the 2.0 update to the driving blueprint. So starting off we can see that I am playing now with 4 replicated clients and these vehicles are now fully replicated out of the box. And there is also a basic example included for the main character controller allowing you to enter and exit the vehicles. You'll also notice that I can now control the lights on all of the vehicles and there are controls for the indicators, brakes and headlights. When the headlights are on, the car enters night mode where the brake lights will illuminate at half strength unless the brake or handbrake is pressed and at which point it would illuminate like a real light brake light would. You'll see now with the final client that I am interacting with and destroying one of the newly updated and replicated BP interactable vehicles and as you can see the windows will now smash and the animation and destruction is now replicated to all of the clients so as we're opening the doors and closing them and making particles spawn that is replicated to all of the other clients so also added was tire screeching sound effects and smoke particles uh, there was also a complete overhaul to the original driving values, making for much more satisfying and responsive vehicles. Better torque, better speed, better turning. Uh, everything was overhauled just to feel more consistent uh, overall. <coughs> so whenever the friction on the tires is high enough, the vehicles will now leave de decals behind on the ground and spawn smoke particles and play sound effects based on the friction strength and this makes for some very convincing and satisfying driving effects uh, where you can drift around corners or do donuts and you can also achieve stationary donuts by holding space and W as you can see here so on top of all of these updates all of the previous functionality still remains with doors being animated as well as the hood and the boot and not only that uh, the steering wheel and gear stick is also animated uh, along with a functional and accurate odometer. So I hope you enjoyed this update and if you use my products please consider leaving a review and other than that thanks for watching I'm just gonna let this video play out now and show off some of the extra driving features that I have and this map I am using is the Country Roads default map by Joe Garth with Rushpy. So thanks for watching and I'll be back with more updates in the future. Thank <laughs> you.